Hello and welcome. In this video we will look into how we can import an image in order to over, like, draw over it in Rhino and how to scale it properly. So easiest way is you go to your top view and you type picture and you choose your image. In this case I want to redraw this rock here and you see I used a yeah like a cutting mat that helps me to define the right scale. So there's inches and there's centimeters over here. So I have a reference size. Let's open this. And yeah, now you can place it. First you have to place the first point. You can also do that by three points if you want to have it spatially. But now let's go just something like this. So currently we didn't really pay attention to the scale. So in order to yeah, adjust the scale, we go to settings and we really make sure that we are in centimeters, for instance. If not, you can change that. And what we, what we want to do now is we want to draw a rectangle. Um, and yeah, let's maybe rotate that image so we can really read that. Can see I can go over here and rotate it along this direction. If you hold the shift button it will uh, align it in like perpendicular uh, directions. And then yeah we want to go the rectangle and now you see it goes from 0 to 40 centimeters and to 25 centimeters. So what we want to do is we want to place our and here I don't actually know let's go for the center of the line and then 40 type 40 centimeters and 25 so this is now this is the the extra dimensions 25 and 40 and now we just need to scale that image here so we can, and we want to scale it from that point because here we already aligned the thing. So we press first here, then we go to the 40 and scale it all the way to this corner because this is 40 centimeters. Yeah, and now I do not really know what's what happened here. No, 25, that's yeah, quite relatively accurate. Um, so yeah, you can align that actually a little bit in Photoshop. Um, should the image somehow be a little bit distorted, you can also go for 1D scale. So let me quickly show that to you. So we still have the image selected. And let's say I want to readjust that here a little bit. So that was now just a 1D transformation. So you see here it's still perfectly fine. Um, yeah, and keep in mind you are translating here from a pixel-based image. So if I zoom in, you see, which probably you can turn off somewhere. And now we are drawing, uh, yeah, in a vector-based uh, space. So there will be some some loss in resolution. So that's basically how you get an image into Rhino with the right scale. And yeah, let me just show you. Let's assume you wanted to have the same image. Uh, you can obviously you can also go to perspective and uh, yeah it's a 3d image so you can could actually rotate it also like this if you wanted to have it into visible in the front view and yeah based on that you can have several images and once you did that probably you want to go to another layer and lock this layer yeah so you actually yeah kind of it's kind of locked now. So that's that. I hope you enjoyed that and see you in the next video. And again, if you have questions or comments on how to do that, please let me know. Thank you very much.